After Midnight, the show we were gonna call 60 Minutes, but that was taken already. <laughs> Let's meet tonight's panelists. He's an actor and comedian you know as the TSA Bay from Insecure and can see in the upcoming season of Animal Control and Abbott Elementary, it's Reggie Conquest. Thanks. Thank you, thank you for having me on this beautiful Black History Month. Yes, yes. White guilt laughter, yes. My last name is Conquest. Hello, Sheila Conquest. That's my mother. Clap for my mom. Yeah, okay. He's a comedian and writer producer on Abbott Elementary, who you can see in his upcoming short, Father of None, and solo show, Sweet Lorraine, at Union Hall in New York on March 29th. It's Jordan Temple. My name is Jordan, like Michael Jordan, and Temple, like the place you pray at. So basically, I'm a Jewish basketball camp. <laughs> And hi, Mom. <laughs> and you know him as the voice of Mr. Peanut Butter from BoJack Horseman and can see his St. Patrick's Day variety show live in LA or via live stream this Sunday. It's Paul F. Tompkins. I believe it was G.I. Joe who said, knowing is half the battle. And guess what happened to him? He got me too <laughs> because somebody knew he put a camera in his guest bathroom. My mom is dead. Will you be my mommy? <laughs> uh, After midnight starts now! <laughs> okay, panelists. It's March 14th, AKA Pi Day, so tonight you'll be playing for a slice of pie. Yeah. It is dairy based, so this show must go quickly. <laughs> so let's start with what's going down in the group chat. Yeah. Panelists buzz in with your jokes, and if you hear this noise, you get 100 points. Yeah. This past week, people have noticed there's a hidden game on Instagram. Nope, not body dysmorphia, it's Pong. <laughs> Yeah, all you have to do is DM an emoji, tap on it, and it becomes a game of Pong. Really? That's right, yeah. Playing games in the DMs isn't just for thirsty dudes anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so panelists, give me a video game inspired pickup line. Paul. Hey, you can just call me Cuphead because I'm quite hard. <laughs> <laughs> Reggie. You wanna play God of Sex? Cause that's God of War. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm a little on the nose. <laughs> Jordan. Girl, are you a sim? Because your body got me going, Zaka Jawiwa. <laughs> Which means I think you're hot. <laughs> <laughs> it's good. Zaka Jawiwa, Zaka Jawiwa. Is that Jar Jar Binks? I'm sorry. <laughs> Is that Jar Jar Binks? <laughs> I know many of you out there are thinking, Taylor, when are you gonna get to the horse news? Well, yes. saddle up, because this past week, thousands of people flocked to Leadville, Colorado for something called skidjoring. White people in the crowd loving it too much. <laughs> oh, a lot of y'all from Montana in here. It's so bored. <laughs> wow, yesterday. <laughs> yes, that's right. Ski drawing is an extreme sport where skiers are towed by horses, blending ski culture with rodeo culture to become the whitest sport of all time. <laughs> yep, that's right. Suck it, Polo. <laughs> Rich people have run out of ideas, so what will their next sport be? Jordan. Extreme getting your black friend a cab. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> That's good. In smart people news, researchers just made a groundbreaking scientific discovery about the best and worst times of day. In summary, 5 a.m. sucks and 5 p.m. rocks. <laughs> wow, was the study called obvious <laughs> everyone knows? Yes. 
Comedians, what are some other obvious scientific discoveries? Paul. Research concludes I'm handsome. Oh. That was a smooth glasses. Wow. That's just Reggie. Doctors finally confirm you go to college to pay for college. <laughs> All right. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Jordan. One out of every five children is a child of Nick Cannon. <laughs> <laughs> Who among us hasn't been jealous of our dogs? They get to eat rawhide, wear cute outfits, and sniff their friends' butts. I like I, that. I do all that stuff, too. <laughs> but now you can even sleep like your dog. A company named Pluffle is selling human-sized dog beds for when you don't have enough self-esteem for a futon. This is, this is what really a, good. This is really good. Why they got a black woman laying in there? <laughs> <laughs> She's working, Jordan. No, she's, she's working. Not. She's getting she's a check. She's in the guest room. <laughs> <laughs> this is, I think this is disgraceful because the sofa is the place where you fall asleep before bed. You don't have another bed in between. <laughs> right? What's happened to this country? So comedians, what other trendy dog-inspired things could people have? Paul. Tired of wasting a whole room on one toilet? Now you can anywhere you like with the new plastic bag. <laughs> Jordan. The tongue extender for when... <laughs> oh my. For when your ass just won't cut it, you dirty bitch. <laughs> I'd also like to add you dirty bitch to the end of mine as well. <laughs> Reggie. Cause I'm kinky, you dirty bitch. <laughs> get more points for everyone taking my tag, you dirty bitch. You know what? You're right. Yeah. Let's go. Stop being a whiny bitch. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I've learned in my 30 years of life is that it costs money. And according to at Lee... <laughs> That's the only thing I've learned. <laughs> and according to at Lee Weiser Envoy on Reddit, the prices are just too damn high. He posted this receipt to complain about paying $77 for two egg and bacon rolls and two iced coffees. I mean, that's, that's not actually that bad. I live in LA, that's the price of one iced coffee here. <laughs> Comedians, you all live in coastal elite cities too. Normalize the price of this expensive breakfast. Jordan. Uh, more money, more yummy. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> <laughs> Boo-hoo, try living in Hollywood. You know how much it costs for one vial of adrenochrome? <laughs> Reggie. Sorry, you brokey. <laughs> you peasants. Go back to where you came from. All right. <laughs> Jordan. That can't even get you in the door at Erewhon. <laughs> you broke bitch. <laughs> Erewhon is nowhere backwards, so. Oh my God. I, yep. Yeah. It's called edutainment. Yeah. <laughs> Jordan is in the lead with 800 points. Yeah.